My name is Stephanie Bauer. I'm in Thurston County, Washington, looking into a missing persons case that sent shockwaves through a small town community over a decade ago. On March 6, 2009, 36-year-old Nancy Moyer vanished suddenly from her home in Tenino. According to police, there have been a number of persons of interest in the last 10 years, but no one convicted of any crime. With the case still wide open, new leads and tips are still required. If you have any information at all related to Nancy's case, we want you to get in touch. My mom was everything. Her smile, she kind of just lit up the whole room when she walked in. Nancy was a very loving, caring mother, very loyal to her friends and family. Um, Nancy was always a good person. The last 10 years have been really hard for me. Going to dances without taking pictures with my mom or turning 18 without her. I didn't like my life a lot. Um, it's hard. <laughs> I should have my mom, but I don't, and <laughs> it sucks. I'm in Tenino meeting James Basinger, who for the last year has been investigating Nancy's disappearance for his podcast, Hide and Seek. I came across Nancy Moyer's case. It was a 10-year-old cold case. She was a young mother. And I'm a father. And that really struck a chord with me and, and got at my heart. We're applying pressure by putting this content out there. I was hoping that if we shake the tree hard enough, something will fall, and it did. All right, well, thanks for driving. Yeah. yeah. You know this area much better than I do. And so you've been here about eight times? Yeah, about Since eight March? Times. Yeah. It's interesting to kind of get the pulse on what everybody thinks happened. How does a girl just disappear from her, you know, front doorstep or on her porch? It just doesn't happen in a small town like this. When Nancy went missing March 6, 2009, it was a regular Friday. Nothing out of the ordinary was happening. She went to work in the Department of Ecology. She would carpool with a guy. They go to work, they go home that day. When Nancy drops him off, she heads to the local grocery store. Quick point out, that's the market that Nancy went to the night that she went missing. So this is the last public place she was seen. Right. At what time? Uh, she checked out from that market around 6.45, based on the receipt that was at her house. 